So usually when I do these videos, I'm showing you everything. And this is a really cool story about Maine. And I want to share this with you, but I really can't physically show you because this is a historical kind of thing, but it's a really cool story. And I want to share this with you. During World War II, nearly 4,000 German prisoners of war were held in camps in Maine. Large camp was in Holton, other camps located in Augusta, Bangor, and Presque Isle. There was also one on Spencer Lake where three Germans had snuck away from harvesting ice. Soon as they did not show up for evening roll call, the largest manhunt in Maine started. Thirty officers from Maine State Police, Sheriff's Office, Maine Morning Service, and FBI showed up the following morning. The three men who escaped made makeshift snowshoes from rail ties, short boards, and homemade knives, and even stole a map from a woodcutter. They made a compass out of a needle, a magnetic electric coil, and a tin can. They planned to travel 100 miles to the coast to get to Maine, to Argentina. The three young men traveled at night, built shelters from snow and pine boughs. After five days after their escape, the Germans were apprehended at gunpoint in a makeshift lean-to. One of the men said they did not want to deal with mosquitoes and black flies in the summer again. One of the escapees, after serving their three-week solitary confinement, took him up on the education, went to the University of Maine, and completed his course, went back to Germany, studied more, came back, worked for NASA on the Apollo mission, became a citizen in 1961. 